Well, good. That's as I was saying. Uh, we're not professionals. We're going to have this down link will be uh, crew interviews with uh, Mike Massimino as the interviewer and uh, of all the crew. And we'll have a, uh, a break about uh, for a little bit, and then we'll start up again. Uh, and if you're ready, we'll, we'll start. And uh, Atlantis, we are ready to proceed. Go ahead. Okay, and it has sound. Here we go. Hello, man. Mike, good. First day in space. How's it going? First full day. You already had, you know, you, let, you blasted off yesterday. How are you feeling today? Feeling much better today. Yeah? It was a very exciting liftoff. And, yes. And uh, trip to space. Here we are. Had a little sleep, had a little chow. Oh, great. We're doing our work here, getting the airlock ready so we can go outside and do EVAs. All right. Which That's is why whole, we're here. That's the whole idea. And Drew, what are you doing? I'm using the tape. Is there any reason why you have sunglasses on in the mid-deck where there's no lights? Because they look I mean, no, no sun? Because they look cool. <laughs> ah, that's my man. Let's go into the, uh, the airlock, see if anyone's there. Hey, John. Yeah. You in the airlock? In the airlock. Poke your head out for the people on Earth. There are no people on Earth. You can't fool me. That's not your head. That's your feet. Stand by. Got my hands full. I still see your feet. What are you doing in here? Hey, man. Welcome. You getting spacesuits ready? Getting the uh, airlock ready. So how's it feel to be here after next. seven years? Oh, it's wonderful. All right. Like old friends. Excellent. All right, hey, Drew, how was your first day in space? Uh, it was good. Yeah? I enjoyed it. You are unbelievable, man. You were working like a maniac right from this get-go, like you you know, you were born here. I like this floating in space. Yeah, it's fun, isn't it? It's a ride. Do a flip for your family and friends. Let's see if I can. Can you do that? Slowly. Slowly. Uh, that's excellent. So has this met your expectations? Uh, exceeded. Really? Oh, yeah. By far exceeded them. Well, you're doing great, man. Thanks, buddy. The ride was, man, that was some ride. That was some, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. We had a lot of fun during yeah, that asset. We, we did have some fun, yeah. Those singing three, songs singing and songs. screaming and yelling. Those three Gs kicked in. And, uh, oh, I was ready yeah, baby. Over. That was fun, though, wasn't it? Man. I'll remember that. It was awesome. It, All right. it, was, it was fun sitting with you, buddy. It was. I enjoyed it. It was a thrill. Thanks. Wait a second. Okay, John. Here you are on the mid deck. So, what did you think of that? What did you think of? So, how was that asset? Oh, it was awesome. Yeah. It was great being on the mid deck. We Wasn't took care fun? of those lockers with the best of them. Yeah, we had we had a fun time. Now, we don't have any windows on the mid deck, of course, but me, you, and Drew had a good time anyway, didn't we? Yes, we did. It was just wonderful. I can't believe we're actually here again. The view's magnificent still, isn't it? It is, absolutely. After seven years. And our spacesuits are here, and we're getting ready to go outside. That'll be great. All right, John. Keep working. Don't slack off too much. Yeah. We're in the mid-deck of Space Shuttle Atlantis. My buddy John Grunsfeld over here. But the person we want to talk to is behind the camera. <laughs> and now, going to be on camera. That's Megan McArthur, <laughs> who is uh, our flight engineer. Uh, Houston, I wasn't really able to see uh, motion behind. And Megan, what are you doing now? Well, we just finished the starboard survey of the orbiter TPS, and yeah. I'm going to get my lunch. So I go to this locker here that says MS2 meals on it, and yeah. I pull it out. It shows me all the food with the green dot uh, yeah. that's mine that's in here. So I look up kind of what I want to eat. And Houston, we're seeing the band at the edge now. How's that work? All right, I found what I want. Okay. Could you go back to the right, take out about yeah, a half? I... Okay, so Megan's now fishing through. We keep getting interrupted okay. by the ground. But this is what the... I was looking for, ravioli. Oh, man, it was great. Very tasty. I just had some. So, put this away, close this up, and then... And Houston, uh, yeah. that looks better to us. This you can warm it as well. You can try it. There it goes. It sits in there for a few minutes to get warm, and then I can eat it, because I don't like it cold. Now, how do you like the food so far? Um, well, so far, all I've had is a peanut butter sandwich, and that was tasty. So, that was good. Yeah. Yeah, the good thing about this food is it's easy to cook. It's yes. not bad to eat, but it's really easy. You just, put it, you just took it out of there and you put it in there. Put it in there, you know? the, like magic, it'll be warm. Yeah, and yeah all, the, all the cooking shows would be jealous. Because <laughs> they got you got to buy ingredients, you got to mix yeah. stuff. This is and easy. All stuff you just throw right in just there. Just throw it right in there. Do you all have right. something in here? You want me to no, put my food you? is never in there. It's always in my stomach. You throw right in there. Hey, Mike, what are you doing? Well, I'm using a computer. And just like a computer at home, we have computers in space. 
I'm checking our flight plans, see what we need to do. And I also can check my email. I've already got some email from my wife and my kids. And it's great to be able to stay in yeah, touch with like this. Recording. And uh, it's a great way for us to tell our friends what yeah, we're we doing and maybe even send a Twitter once in a while. <laughs> not that often, but once in a while. What does the flight plan say we're supposed to be doing? Oh, right no. Now? I bet it's not fooling around filming. We're doing uh, inspections of the orbiter right now, the space shuttle with the inspection boom. And we're also checking out our spacesuits for the spacewalk. So it's a busy day, and things are just going to keep getting busier. Are we going to get it all done? Uh, yes, absolutely, 100%. And we're going to have fun doing it. Excellent. All right. Uh, yeah. And uh, we'll have the mini camera available test. if you have any more to you later. It's a test. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But you're setting up for IMAX. You've also set up for what other kind of video? You're doing all kinds of photo photography. We're doing high definition. Video. So we got some high definition down right. yesterday of the ET uh, tank. Yeah. And we'll the be doing uh, this is high definition. Right. And then uh, we'll do kind of a crew summary at the end of the day. So how do you like filmmaking? You think it might be a second career for you? Could be. Yeah. Have you know, the piloting. What kind of movies would you make? <laughs> They'd be all uh, humorous movies. All right, man. Thanks a lot, Greg. Okay, you know, great. thanks. It was a wild ascent, by the way. Any, anything else you want to say to your family? Uh, love <laughs> to be in space. I miss him, and I'll see him soon. Awesome. Thanks okay. for the uh, performance of your crew so far. I know it's still early, but how are you feeling? They're doing well. I'm uh, very impressed. It's been a tough two days. Uh, you know, 109 was tough. This has been more packed than that was, uh, but people have really pulled through. We had a long day yesterday. Uh, today was tough with all the inspection ops, but everybody uh, chimed in, did more th their job and a little bit more. That's uh, my motto, and I was real happy with how well it went. Sounds like you're a slave driver. Is that true? I know. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, and what about that hat? We got think? a new uh, SCS 125 hat. It's pretty sharp. Do you think it got paint spilled on it like everybody else no, does? No, I think it looks good. I think it looks great. It's Hubble Pictures in a hat. Yeah, it looks awesome. So I had to fly it. I wanted to take it with me. Very inspiring. That's it. Well, hey, thanks a lot for being such a great commander, and I hope we can do as well in the rest of the mission as we've done so far in the first two days. Uh, what do you think? I think we will. I think... Uh, the best part about being a commander here is having a great crew that does everything, and I just sit around. <laughs> All right, anybody watching us, remember this is non-edited and we're not professionals. See ya. <laughs>